Well, a young Yukon woman was one of the first clients at a rehab center in Regina. A car crash had dealt her a serious blow. But she has a new goal, the Paralympic Games, and something even beyond that. Tonight on Only in Canada, the CBC's Cheryl Rennie takes you to the Saskatchewan capital for a story that might make you cheer. I feel incredible. I feel strong. Unstoppable, maybe? There isn't much that can stop Jess Froughton, even though she only started racing seven months ago. I sucked at every sport. I wasn't very coordinated, but as soon as I got in a racer, I just loved it. The 25-year-old got into her first racer here at this Regina rehab facility. She came here from Yukon after a car crash there three and a half years ago left her paralyzed from the waist down. What Jessica's gained and the time she's gained um, is nothing short of miraculous. She does things quickly. She picks up on everything very fast and she kind of gives it everything she's got. When she's devoted to something, she goes. Good. She trains for hours every day, forcing her muscles and nerves to work harder. And it's working. Good. She's regaining feeling and movement in her hips and upper legs. Good. Even up. It's completely changed my life. It's given me the confidence to be more independent and to go out and try these things like racing or other sports. A week and a half ago, Froughton went to her first outdoor track meet. She won gold in all five races and qualified for this summer's Canada Games. When she got off the plane, she came back here to celebrate again. Here they are. This is the first medals I think I've ever won in my life. The trainers here have no doubt that Froughton can make the Paralympics and maybe one day even leave the wheelchair behind. Cheryl Rennie, CBC News, Regina. If you have an idea for Only in Canada, we want to hear from you. Just go to our webpage, cbcnews.ca slash onlyincanada to send us your ideas, photos and videos.